hey 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 and welcome to brooklyn's barbie bay and we are back today with another doll fashion haul i have yet bought another pack from ele dolls i bought several so i'm chopping up my videos and i have decided to go over um all of these sets that i've purchased with you guys super excited about it can't wait to show you what we have today but first I had to tell you guys a story like back in the day when they had um, the VIP dolls I had like all of them I do have the majority of them right and I had my China McLean doll and I was extremely excited I was like trying on clothes because I wanted to put her in my next um, doll review haul and she broke a whole head because it was so fragile the peg broke the whole neck broke I was so so distraught very upset and then I was like, you know what? Maybe it's time to rebody her or try to find a way to rebody her. So I jumped on Amazon. I got the petite style um, fashion. I think it's the Barbie Signature doll, the, the newer one um, with the yellow shoe, the color blocking one. And you guys, I got her. Doesn't she look amazing? I was so excited to see my China doll. Look at the rooted eyelash. Like the rooted eyelashes were so gorgeous back then. But now her body is even better and it fits perfectly on this gorgeous um made to move body. So I get to now create her um with new fashions and I'm absolutely loving it. And I'm thinking about getting another petite body so I can um, do the other dolls that I have like her in the VIP series kind of give them new bodies as well but so excited so I'm happy and all in my feelings today because I have a brand new China McLean doll and she's got a great body and she's got a made to move body and she still looks absolutely amazing so I had to share that special moment with everyone because she is one of my favorite I mean like you won't know how you have an absolute favorite doll that is my absolute favorite doll so I'm feeling the way. But <clears throat> with that said, let's get into these doll clothes. So in this pack, we've got some yellow, we've got some black and white, and we have got some green. Okay, and this is coming again from the ELE doll. And if anybody wants to look at that so they know where to go to grab it, this is where you're going to grab it from. So today we have in our set have our dolls to try on some of these. Where's my trusty table? I always got to have this little table to put everything on and show you guys. So first and foremost, we have this really cute yellow bag. It has gold handles. Very cute on the front of it. As you can see, it has a bow. Very, very cute. Velcro's open, as you can hear. And you can put some items in that. That's really, really cute, you guys very cute so we've got a yellow purse in this set we also have a green chanel inspired bag very cute with the little um chain on it super cute so you've got two purses this also comes with a pair of yellow heels in this set so we've got some yellow heels Okay. It also comes with a pair of black heels. Let me take these out of the bag. Oh, these are kind of cute. They're like Mary Jane um, heels. Oh, those are cute. So you've got some Mary Jane heels. See that? Cute. We have a yellow belt. You've got a cute little yellow belt here. And then we have a, looks like we have a black and white dress. We also have a, what looks like a faux leather white jacket. And we also have what looks like some green pants. So I'm interested to see how this is all going to come together. 
let's go ahead and get started and get our dolls on the runway okay and here we have the first outfit um, I paired the yellow belt with the black and white um, dress added the yellow purse and also gave her the yellow shoes all of the items here all come in the set that I purchased so I thought this was one really cute creative way of wearing it so the um, this is a curvy doll she absolutely can fit the dress very well it's nice and um, really flowy the material is really pretty you guys it feels really great um, and I think it looks absolutely amazing on her you know you can also wear this with the black shoes if you wanted to do that or you could have popped a color of green in there and that still would have went I absolutely love this on the curvy doll so your curvy dolls can absolutely wear this outfit and can absolutely wear the shoes okay let's go to the next outfit okay so in the second outfit as you can see the pants do not fit but the jacket does fit I had paired because this outfit does not come with the bottom so I found a um, black unitard that I was gonna put up over this um, but the jacket does fit our doll our clurry doll um, but it just does not fit the pants and I don't want to you know mess the pants up right now so on this uh, particular doll just the jacket fits um, but it would have been a really great set had it worked out but I have a lot of doll clothes so I definitely could find some things that can go with this but just wanted you to see that the jacket does fit and um, you are gonna have to find like a little top or something to go with it um, for your doll okay so we'll go on to our next doll oh that stinks okay now here we have our fresh doll and as you can see the pants come up very little I paired it with a different top but it does not snap in the back you guys so your dolls that are a little bit more curvier so your fresh doll can it can come up but it can't close um, I love the fact that these are like flare leg pants so I can't wait to see one of our dolls that can wear it um, but the jacket does fit the top became like a little crop top which I thought was gonna be super cute but we'll try it on another doll to see if it works just wanted you to see that the fit did not fit when it came to our fresh doll and the back is all out there so let's try the dress on her okay so here we have the white dress and I paired it with some green shoes we gave her a green purse and took off the belt with it and it flared it out a little bit more so this dress looks absolutely beautiful fits wonderfully on your doll um, and looks good with the green I absolutely love this black and white dress and this is a, a yes for me as well so so far we know that our curvy girls can't necessarily do the green pants but they definitely can wear this beautiful um, dress and the accessories work wonderful with the ladies as well as the white faux leather coat okay let's go to our next doll just want to kind of pan down and let you see that's how she looks with the shoes and the shirt and, and the skirt dress I'm sorry I think everything looks wonderful okay let's go to our next doll okay and now here we have our integrity doll and I'm going to pan down so you can see she's got on the yellow heels she has on the purse she has the um, dress on with the yellow belt and I think it looks absolutely stunning on her looks absolutely great I love this look it looks amazing the dress fits great on her I absolutely love it let's see her in the next outfit okay so here is the integrity doll and let me just show you how flooding these pants are on the integrity doll okay so look how high they come up I'm gonna bring her in closer so you can get a good look at this I don't really like that and I know these dolls scale a little bit taller um, so you know I get it I just and then the proportionate usually these dolls can wear just about any type of clothes but look at how oh, I'm gonna put the purse down for a minute but look at how that's made there if you can see it's like higher on this side than it is on this side it's not really proportioned that well um, and even in the back so I mean I wouldn't put these pants on my integrity dolls because not unless it was a shorter doll um, and I might just try this on a petite doll just kind of show us what this possibly could look like but right now this is what the and then even with the coat the arms are, are too short like I wouldn't want to put this on my integrity doll so even though she can fit it I definitely wouldn't let her wear this particular outfit but let's see what our made to move doll looks like okay so here we have our 
regular um, articulated Barbie doll. And as you can see, the fit does fit. I just paired it with a white t-shirt. We know that the um, jacket would definitely go, but I want to kind of play around with it and wear it with the other outfit. But just wanted to add a sparkle of beautiful yellow into this just to kind of show you guys. So here she is with the yellow shoe. She's got her yellow bag, her belt. Um, and I like this outfit on her a whole, I like this. I really like this on her a lot. So it looks like the pants would fit good on a made to move Barbie or a regular articulated Barbie doll. And I think she looks absolutely amazing, amazing in this. Let me know your thoughts. Let's see her in the second outfit. And here we have for the last outfit, we have the jacket with the dress, which I think is super cute. I added the green um, mock Chanel bag, and then I added the green heels with it. I think it looks absolutely great. I think because she's got this beautiful red hair, it kind of sets it off as well. So this is our, bring her in a little closer so you can see, but this is our um, second outfit on our articulated doll and I think she looks absolutely great in this I really do I really like every bit of it um, and I think she looks really good in the green black and white so this is our last outfit on our dolls let me know what you think about this particular set let me go back over everything with you in this outfit now the only thing that on, that she has on right now these green shoes are my green shoes so it does not come with the set so when you think about what we're talking about we're talking about her beautiful dress we're definitely talking about her gorgeous jacket that this came with this also came with bring our lovely um, table over remember you're going to get this purse you also get a yellow belt, which was very helpful. I love having colorful belt and colorful um, accessories. You have the little faux green um, Chanel bag. This also came with a pair of yellow heels. It also came with a pair of black heels. It also came with these green pair of pants, which on your um, smaller dolls looks absolutely fabulous. And that pretty much is all the set came with. But if you have other pieces, like I did in my set, I had a white shirt. I also had a green and white, green, white and black shirt that I could have paired with this. So, you know, anything, I also have a, I'm sorry, a black um, unitard here. Like just a just a black unitard to go over you know so if you have like a couple other things in your accessory toolbox you also can add and mix and match i have a, a as you can see up there i have that big blue purse if i wanted i mean blue big green purse if i want to use it i had another one um down there so i have a thing full of different green shoes you could use so you know to accessorize and put it all together super cute i should have added these cute little um, yellow glasses on here because I do have these yellow shades that would have just popped this and made it look really good So I'm excited. I'm really glad I got this set um, And I will drop down in the comments in the description section to tell you exactly how much this set was because like off my head I just do not remember um, But I, I don't think it was that much um, But for getting two purses and so a lot of accessories and these sets I think it was really a great um, deal that I did get with this one. So I'm very very happy I love this one much more than I love the last one that I kind of shared with you guys, which I think was more of the 70s vibes with the jeans, the jean set, and also like a plaid set. So let me know what you think. Like which outfit did you like the best about this? Um, I hate that they couldn't get it on our Kirby dolls, but I tell you what, you guys, I just ordered from Hope Couture. And if you're not aware, they're on Instagram. If you look up Hope Couture, they can customize their outfits for every doll type which means it can be Monster High, it can be your curvy doll, it can be um, uh, your petite doll, I mean the G3 dolls, they go down the list to say what that outfit that you're looking at, they make it for that doll size. So I just did a whole haul where I bought a lot of curvy doll fashions, okay? So we're really gonna have an amazing time looking at those fashions from Hulk Couture. Um, and I still have a couple of more of ELE dolls 
fashions that we're going to be looking at as well. I'm super excited um, as we get ready to roll into the fall. We've got some great things to look at on Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. So if you like this content, please go ahead and hit the like button for me. If you're not following me, go ahead and hit the subscribe button for me and subscribe to our channel. We love your comments. I love your energy, you guys. And please let me know what else you all would like to see. Um, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought about the dolls. Let me know which, which one you like the most. Let me know if you'd pay this amount for whichever amount I have down there in the in the comments, I mean in the um, description section, if you feel like it's worth it or not. Um, and if there are some other doll clothings that you'd like to see, let me know. I think I'm gonna do one with some of my old retro clothing that I've had from like a while ago and show you how I can kind of style some things with some older things um, added to some of our newer clothes. So thank you guys again for such an amazing day. And thank you as usual for watching Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. Bye.